get coding help from Gemini Code Assist now for free. This is with highest usage limits. Here is Gemini Code Assist. You are able to modify code. You can generate code with your natural language with a large context window. Can get more done with just a prompt. You are able to refactor code, fix errors in the code, find the sources in multiple IDs and multiple languages completely for free with a higher limit. AI coding assistant where developers want it at no cost. Now available in VS Code and JetBrains IDEs has code completion, generation, chat capability. Here is an example where you can identify error and fix it directly in VS Code. Customizable, actionable feedback on your pull request with Gemini Code Assist for GitHub. So this is the different GitHub integration. So I'm going to show you two things. One is how you can integrate this with Visual Studio Code. And the second thing, how to integrate with GitHub. Let's get started. Gemini Code Assist is another competitor to GitHub Copilot, Cursor and Minsurf. So they are releasing it as a plugin. So you can visit this page and click install and it will automatically open in VS Code. If you haven't downloaded VS Code, you can directly download from their website. And it's a really nice code editor, completely for free. So this is what they provide. 180,000 code completions per month. Support all programming language in the public domain. 128,000 token context window. That is really nice. So once after you install, on the left hand side, you will see an icon like this. So click on this Gemini Code Assist. When you start first, it will ask you to sign in. So sign in with your Google account. Even without any cloud account, you should be able to use this as per their promise. So you can even ask some basic questions. I have a code here. So I can even ask at knowledge agent what this code does. Now this is explaining me the code on what this code does. Now I can ask you to refactor the code. Refactor the code. And now it's working behind the scenes. And here is a refactored code with class functions and the main function to call. The original code doesn't have a class. So this is more structured. So I can just click this icon here and it will automatically apply the difference. So you can see the difference here and then I can accept or decline here. Clicking accept and it accepts the change. Now I can ask convert this into a Flask application with API endpoint. So after requesting that, I'm clicking send. Now it's going to convert this to a Flask application. And here's the Flask application. So I can just click the same icon as before and it'll automatically show you the difference compared to how it was before. So I'm going to accept and all the code got changed now. Even if there's any error in the code, I can just ask identify error in the code and fix it. Now here's the corrected code. I'm going to click this again and you can see the error got fixed. That's what I changed to test this application. Going to accept the change and that. And the final thing which I want to try is to create multiple files. So I'm going to ask create a front end in a separate file for this code. And I can see an index.html code here. So I'm asking you to create the file. Create me the file. So it's giving me guidance on how to create the file, but it's not automatically creating the file. So that is the major difference which I see here compared to Cursor or Winsurf. Because Cursor or Winsurf have the agentic behavior and proper tool call functionality. So it utilizes that to create the files, make all the modification automatically. I see that is the thing missing here. Apart from that, if you are first time coder or beginner starting to code or starting with an application, you can directly use this code assist to assist you with code generation completely for free. Do let me know in the comments below what you think about this. Next, I will show you how you can integrate this with GitHub. So here is a GitHub application. So here I have already installed. So it says configure. But if you haven't installed, it will automatically give you an option to install. This is the actual GitHub website. So once after you click install, it will show you the list of repos you want to install this Gemini code assist. By installing on those repo, this can provide AI powered code reviews on pull requests with automatic pull request summaries, ready to commit code and the ability to invoke Gemini for assistant at any point on the PR. So all this automatically integrated for free. So do try this. Considering you already like code assist, I also created another video in regards to cursor. 
which I highly recommend for you to watch and I will see you then.